you really want me to talk about group 13? Well, don't fall asleep. This is the boring group. Oh, oh, the boron group. Sorry, my mistake. All of the members of the boron group are metals, but they're still just a bunch of softies. Thallium can be cut with a knife at room temperature. Aluminum and indium are pliable. And gallium with a melting temperature of 85 degrees will even melt in your hand. Ununtrium is a synthetic element with a half-life of only 19.6 seconds. Boron is an exception to this softness though, especially when it is bound with carbon. Boron carbide is so strong that it is used as tank armor, ceramic armor, padlocks, and brake linings. These metals are also very light, aluminum in particular. Because of how light it is, aluminum is used to build airplanes and is increasingly used in cars to increase fuel efficiency. Indium, in its oxidized form, is even used in the screen on which you are watching this. Indium oxide is essential for LCD screens because it conducts electricity but is transparent to visible light. Huh, I guess they're not so boron after all.